Ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Welcome back to Academia. Last time we finished the club here, we started setting up a clinic and figured out sort of how big the school is going to get. Although, I don't think it's as far out this wide as it is out this side. Uh, let's actually check that. How big is it? Uh, so this wing goes back like 29 blocks, 29, 29 blocks, and this one goes back 21. Ideally, do I want it to be the same, or should I keep it a little bit quirky? I'm going to keep it a little bit quirky. You know, why not? I guess what we could always do is add a corridor along this way anyway, but I'm not too fussed about that in a minute. Our workers are here, trying to set up the outer wall. That's why the clinic is taking so long to make, which is fine. I guess while we wait, we could just see what we can do uh, for expanding horizons. Build a library and build a computer lab. We also want to get sophomore students. How do you even get sophomore students? You can. Uh, oh wait, can I? If I edit the classroom. Oh, I can change what. Okay, I'm following. That makes sense. So we can get some bigger classrooms. Basically, we can make this entire thing a classroom, which would be pretty cool. Um, right, let us get our wall outline tool and see how big this is. Twenty-eight, annoyingly even. Uh, okay, so we can't split it up in half like equally which is a little bit frustrating unless we add one onto the end or take one off actually you know what I think I'm gonna take one off because I can do that so I'm going to let's put a brick wall the entire way down here <laughs> and annoyingly that's gonna cut off the cafeteria so let's take off the cafeteria zone and put on the cafeteria zone like that be like, oh, you're not inside, you're not inside, but they are, so we'll ignore that. Then demolish that section. So, a little bit weird how I'm doing it, but uh, we'll see how it goes. Okay, do that. Get rid of this outline. That's fine. Okay, that should get done soon. I mean, it's recess, so nine ab absent due to sicknesses. It looks like we're gonna have to hire a couple more janitors, annoyingly. But uh, how much? $50 a day? That's fine. You know, we're not losing too much money per day. Although our utilities are getting a bit expensive. Our cafeteria, I'm a bit worried that once we add the extra classrooms, that our cafeteria isn't going to be big enough. Wait, what wall is that? Oh, the brick wall. Oh, they haven't actually built it yet. That's good. <laughs> They've made the clinic, though, which is fantastic. You know, we've got a working clinic, which is great. We can now add in our concrete tile underneath that floorboard, or that, that door. Uh, we want to focus, I think, on getting like a computer lab set up, or maybe the library. I feel like the library should be set up in the corner, bookshelf, table, you know. Um, we don't need a librarian, which is pretty good. Um, okay, let's get this in. Uh, like, let's put the door there, just there, okay. And let's get our concrete tiles down as well. And you know what, we may as well, it's like, concrete the entire... Oh, that's a lot of money. That is a lot of money. Okay, never mind. I'm spending all my money on concrete tiles. This is like Prison Architect all over again. Let's go like that. Go like that. Okay, we're not actually spending all of our money. This is okay. This is okay. Uh, let's actually have the computer lab have, like, a dual door system here. Like, one door at either end. That might be pretty cool. And then we'll put it like that. Okay. So we're going to try and set them both up at the exact same time. <laughs> um, and hopefully we'll get our... Oh yeah, we can actually do the expanding horizons. There we go. We'll get a bit of cash from that. That's good, that's good. Okay, get rid of the... Um, those things. Okay, objects. Let's go library. Where are we? There we go. So we just need bookshelf, table and chairs. So we could just set the bookshelves up to be along the back. I mean, they're only a hundred dollars, so might as well. Is that going to fit? Yes, it fits like a glove. How about that? And then we've got like our student tables, um, just like this, I guess. Hey, that doesn't look too bad. I'm happy with that. Actually, really happy with that. Okay, cool. How's that for a sick library, huh? This table is too close. I don't like it. Um, let's rotate that. 
because there wasn't a gap between that table and the other one. So if I do, then it's going to go there and it's going to be in front of the door. So let's just put one there, and that will be that. Okay, and then we've got the place with the students and stuff. That's fantastic. That's fine. Okay, <laughs> our workers are going to take so long doing this. Uh, that's the only thing. So let's speed everything up like a lot. Uh, where's computer lab? There we go. So is it just going to be chairs and computers? Which is fine. I'm happy with that. <laughs> that sounds easy to do. Uh, computer lab. I could hire some more workers for this to go quicker, but I don't really want to. Chairs, computers, and indoors. Okay, easy enough. Um, wow, I don't think we need a big computer lab. I don't think we need a big computer lab at all. This is huge. We could make a we could make this into a classroom, you know. I'm always tempted to just make that into a classroom instead. Wait, is it the end of the day? It is the end of the day. Okay, cool. That was a very quick day. That was like six minutes, and the day's over. Basically, because we're not even looking at what's happening, we're just looking at. Can I see my students' grades now? Why are they not? They don't have grades yet. How long are the days? How long is the year? It doesn't tell you anything. Cleanliness, overall grade, F. oh wait, passing rate F, cleanliness B, overall grade F, okay, so I'm going to turn this into a classroom, so I guess having the doors here makes no sense, um, so if I literally just, oh wait, hang on, no, that hasn't been built yet, cancel that, cancel that, put the brick walls in, uh, obviously if we're going to have a door, then it's probably going to have to be this side, um, so yeah, let's put it like there. I feel like we can have like one giant class here. Probably for like not freshmen, but maybe if we say junior or seniors, you know. So we've got like a couple of, uh, we're going to need to expand the canteen. I think the canteen is going to get extended up to here. That might make more sense. So if we do that, ooh, ideas coming to mind. We can then maybe turn this into our computer lab. Again, that does seem like it's a little bit too big. But if we extend the canteen up there, that's fine. Um, computer lab there, and then like two classrooms here. Maybe like, have this is the senior, this is the sophomore, and this is the junior. Or maybe sophomore, junior, senior. Sophomore, junior, senior. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. So how wide is this again? 27. So if I split it in half, 26, so that's 13. So put it there. Okay, we're doing things, we're doing things. There we go. Do a little bit like that. Go back to the layout and erase it. Boom, gone. No one knows what was there. Holy smokes, the library's done. <laughs> okay, that was quick. Um, wow, they really finished up there, didn't they? Okay, let's grab our concrete tiles and we'll put them down. Okay, our workers are going super quick now, which is great, I love it. Put that there as well. To start building in some walls, or some doors even, not walls. Because otherwise they're going to get trapped in there. Okay, it's already fifth period. Um, right, let's see. We need some more janitors. Wait, hang on, no, the janitors are fine. I don't know, I'm so confused. There's like, no trash anywhere, it's not dirty or anything. So... I don't know what they were talking about. Can I extend the toilets up to there? No, no, that's fine. This is going to be our computer lab. Let's do it. Let's make this our computer lab. Boom. So we're going to need some computers. Um, obviously going to need a door to get in, which I guess we can have on this side. Okay, that'll be fine. Objects, computer lab. So we obviously need some computers. I guess what we could do is we can sort of like split it up so they're like their own individual little things. Um, so walls, like that. And then if we grab like a wall, put a brick wall like there and there, then they've got like their own study space, I guess. Then they need chairs and more computers. So uh, let's grab some more computers. Put it there, there, and there. Cool. And then let's grab the brick walls and put it in like that. And then they just need some chairs uh, to put there, 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 there. Done. We've made a little computer lab. Cool. Um, have we got the concrete tiles in there yet? Yes, we have. Okay, sweet. Let's speed things up so we get this done quickly because <laughs> I don't want to be hanging around. These guys are stuck. 
Um, build a door. Please and thank you. Do that ASAP. Oh, uh, they're not going to do it. They're not going to do it. Uh, I also realize that I missed that concrete tile. Guys, look, I told you, build the door. Just, just, just build it. Oh, wait, it's dismissal, that's why. Oh, hang on, if they're stuck, can they... Oh, okay, that's good, that's fine. Okay, day number six. Let's go. Who knows how long these days are, but... I'm hoping I get another classroom up before... Um, before the the students sort of all reset or whatever. Resetting students. <laughs> what a weird concept. Yeah, yeah, wash the dishes is fine. Uh, what we will do as well is demolish the wall there so that we can expand our canteen. We're going to have to dismantle that bin and that bin. Hey, okay, students are in. Two students are dirty, uh, <laughs> due to dirty. Two students are ill or absent due to sickness, which is fine. I can deal with two students. That's absolutely fine. Okay, pause. Build concrete tiles. Straight across there and straight up. Gonna edit that zone, remove it, and I'm going to put it back in. Okay, cafeteria. Fantastic. We can get some more tables in here, I guess. Uh, if we put them like there, that's not gonna be. <sighs> Damn me and my OCD. It's gotta be. It's gotta be normal. If I put one there, then it would have to be like. Mm, it would back up onto these tables. But honestly, I think I'm fine with that. Let's just go for it. Like this. I mean, it's just gonna be fine. We fine. No one will notice. There we go. Done. Right. Let's. Um, oh, we got bulletin boards. Oh, that's fantastic. I, I really like the whole decorating thing, but obviously we we're not there yet. Uh, we also need to get like some more food counters and plate counters. Let's grab another food counter and put it there, and we get two more plate counters. So it's basically symmetrical. In fact, it is symmetrical. <laughs> I only just realised that it is perfectly symmetrical. Okay, grab our trash cans, which seem to rotate whenever we put them down, but that's fine. It's fine. Where are the builders? Are they all stuck in there. Have we got any builders that are doing any building other than that? We got a couple of builders who is working solo on trying to. Guys, seriously, can you not? Can you not just build this door? <laughs> There's actually quite a lot of kids that go to the uh, the library, which seems good. Maybe that'll help increase their grades. That'd be fantastic. No, maybe not. <laughs> um, students, see that they're, they're just got like, oh, because it's on junior, doy. Hey, they've actually got grades now. That's great. They're really hungry. That's bad. Motivation's going up. Discipline isn't fantastic. Wonder how you can, wait, transfer, wait, what? Transferee. Oh, transferee admissions. Wait, what does that mean? I can get one freshman. What? Arrive. Oh, that's. So in two days' time, I can get more students. Oh, I see. So this is how you can fill up classrooms. Ah, that makes sense. You know, if I give these guys something to do, will they actually do it? Let's see. Uh, I'm going to say this is going to be a classroom. But this is going to be... I can't... No, I can't change it until it's built. Okay, then fine. Whatever. Chalkboard, student chair, office table. Okay, so... I put, probably put the door in the wrong place, to be fair. But let's go back into objects, classroom. And let's say... Okay, we, we want the chalkboard in the middle. We can do it in the middle now. Okay, that's fine. The chalkboard in the middle. So the student chairs. So I want, like, one there. And two... Um, I can't put one there. Oh, I can put one there. And then I want to double up there. So how about this? We've now got four per row. So we're getting loads of students in this one. Then we'll maybe do like a single row there. Yeah, how about that? Then we'll have our um, office thing in the middle there, or in the corner. And put that there. Technically, now technically we do have room. I realise that I just did that as well. Is it because they're trying to get in here? Is that what's wrong? Um, now the door's in the wrong place, so if I put the door there, 
Yeah, technically we've got enough room there for another row of um, like student chairs. Oops, wrong button. So, yeah, we're going to have loads of students in there. That's going to be great. Okay, I am going to fire these guys. One, two... No, I want, I want you. Three, fired. You're all fired. Come back in here, hire a new one. Just please work. Just, just build. That's what I want you to do. Just build. Are you going to do anything? Are you going to do anything? It's like, why are they getting so stuck? Why are they getting so confused? Because they're getting dismissed. I don't know. Maybe this game is a little bit broken. I mean, who knows? Anyway, that is going to do it for today, guys. Hope you all enjoyed this episode of... Uh, Academia. Join me next time when hopefully we can get this all figured out because I would like to get more students in. It would be great because then we get more money, which would also be great. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.